In this video, we're going to subtract two two-digit numbers using column subtraction. Here is a number sentence. 87 subtract 52. We need to line the numbers up correctly when we're doing column subtraction. So we have the tens in one column and the ones in another column. The number 87 has eight tens and it has seven ones. The number 52 has five tens and it has two ones. So now that we're set up, we can subtract the digits in each column, starting from the right. 7 take away 2 is 5. 8 take away 5 is 3. So the answer is 35. Let's have a look at another example. 64 take away 47. Remember, we need to line our numbers up correctly. The number 64 has six tens and it has four ones. The number 47 has four tens and it has seven ones. So now that we're set up, we can subtract the digits in each column, starting from the right. We can't subtract seven from four, so we need to borrow a 10 from the tens column. If we borrow a 10, six tens becomes five tens. So now we have 14 take away seven, which is seven. So now we need to do five take away four, which is one. So the answer is 17. Let's have a look at one more example. 92 subtract 83. Remember, we need to line our numbers up correctly. The number 92 has nine tens and it has two ones. The number 83 has eight tens and it has three ones. So now that we're set up, we can subtract the digits in each column, starting from the right. We can't subtract three from two, so we need to borrow a 10 from the tens column. If we borrow a 10, nine tens becomes eight tens. So now we have 12 take away three, which is nine. So now we need to do eight take away eight, which is zero. So the answer is nine.